I love this control. I'm like 123 pounds and I use this for all shapes and sizes. Um, so full disclosure guys, I'm uh, recovering from a surgery I had about eight weeks ago. I had a double mastectomy, so some of my movements may be slower than normal, but I'm gonna do the best that I can and I'm very happy to be here. Um, what else guys? So let's just have fun, um, like two long days. Everything that Charles taught is probably like swirling in your head right now. Mm. Um, so let's start with a warm up guys. Uh, let's just start with uh, pulling guard. So I come from an MMA based kind of school so we don't pull guard a lot unless you're a whiz on your back. But if, if you're gonna, we're gonna be working on our back so let's just warm up with pulling guard. So um, I'm gonna use Lori here. We're gonna start with with our partner in standing position. My elbows are tucked and I'm looking for a sleeve and collar grip. Okay guys, sleeve and collar grip. So I'm just gonna move her around a little bit. When I feel like she's a little bit off balance, I'm gonna put my foot on her hip, the same side that I have the sleeve. Look, I'm already pulling her in a little bit and I'm gonna fall on my left hip. Okay guys, look, this foot is extending her and pulling her in here. And then from here guys, I'm gonna hip up and then bring her in and close that guard. So from here, I already have the collar grip, so I'm just going to bring my knees in, grab the overhook, and then sweep the collar. Okay, guys? So this is just a warm-up. Take your time. So we're starting here. We'll go back and forth with our partner. One hand on the collar, one hand on the sleeve. Move her around a little bit. So I'm not going to put my foot that has exactly so it's here or she can just push to the side and get to my side control it's the side that i have the sleeve right guys so i'm moving her around so my foot so it's not straight guys it's here because i want to control i'm going to push her and pull her in so i'm already controlling her posture right so i'm going to fall on this left hip common mistakes is people kind of fall on their back and then they lose that control here so look i'm falling keeping that leg extended and then i'm going to hip up and close that guard. And then we're getting to that overhook. So you already have this collar grip, just bring your knees in and feed to the collar. Sound good guys? One, two, three.